Welcome back everyone to The Crafting Dead. Today we have Jazzer back with us and we're going to be working on the base today for the most part of the video and then towards the end we're going to transition over to a town and try to loot up and see if we can run into any bandits or some good people and just interact with them. So if you're excited for today's episode definitely go ahead and hit that like button. You guys have been just showing so much support for this series and I really do appreciate it. I got some exciting news. Uh, Roleplay will be coming um, in the upcoming few weeks so stay tuned for that a lot of cool things and if you want to be a part of it uh, which is reference to the role play there will be a link down below in the description if you want to be a, a we're looking for builders uh, voice actors and people who can body act and if you're interested in any of those categories go ahead and apply and I'll be choosing a few people that fit the application but yeah without further ado let's get started in today's video Jazzer welcome again man <laughs> it's Thanks, been a long man. time so uh we're gonna be doing a lot with the top of the base and uh, you may be wondering why it's because as you can see our featuring neighbors down there who are allies have some pretty cool bases and we want to we ran across a few bases in the past that look pretty cool is that right yeah true we just have to fortify we don't want people throwing grenades over <laughs> that's 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 a fact right there so uh what we were doing off screen was we prepped a lot of this so that it would make for an easier time building so the first thing that we're gonna do is completely add another wall surrounding our base as of right now and, and that's gonna i think allow us to go up two blocks if i'm not mistaken right oh actually yeah, should be another two blocks i think it's a full three. Oh, maybe we'll find out in just a second what the results are of this oh no it oh. is two okay perfect yeah that's cool. what we wanted from the beginning um, so the whole plan with up the kind of like putting another level to the base right now is one like Jazzer just explained grenades don't get thrown over um, and I also want to fortify it and have kind of like a, a military um, how do I explain it? like a military view like a sniper ground view from the top yeah. of the base okay yeah we just have to plop some windows right here and we should be able to do that yeah so we're, we're gonna put a few windows with sandbags and some barbed wire obviously we're gonna try to finish as much of this as possible i know i feel like a lot of you are interested in the whole building process because some people don't really see like the amount of money that goes into it that's what's really difficult about surviving on the servers i think it's just the ability to survive and build your own base it's a lot of money it takes a lot of effort True. Uh, so that's all the freaking um i think that's all the stone we have for the walls i think we undercounted that oh damn okay well i could go back to the shop and buy some more yeah I'll, i have a few more stone i'll make a few more and then i'll let you do that to the shop okay um do that. Build a few more stone walls just want to make sure i craft the right ones i just made three more so we need a few more stacks and then we should be good okay i'm gonna do a full hot bar okay perfect um so the idea after we finish building the top is like i said we're gonna you're gonna see i'm gonna replicate it and then from there we're gonna try to uh do the same thing and like i said in the last episode we're looking to add people to our factions or our clan um and that's going to be taking place soon enough uh we'll get that going so i'm excited for that so stay tuned for things uh like that it's exciting so also i also want to mention i want to do some more interactive um kind of involvement with the community so if you guys haven't heard or i kind of hinted towards it a little bit i've reached out in the discord and i want to do a king of the hill and that's going to take some time to make it happen but it would be really nice to have a group of like 10 people or 15 people or as many we can get on the atlanta server and do a king of the hill and with the winner they'll get a chance to be in my video and they would probably get some other cool rewards so that's something that i think a lot of you will be interested in if you are let me know in the comment sections i think it would be a lot of fun um, I'd like to see that. Oh, dude, it would be an awesome time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish up these two platforms here, two more floor platforms. So that would complete the second floor, which has been lacking a lot for the last few episodes. We'd be kind of, uh, <laughs> kind of doing some other things, you know, going around and exploring. All right, there we go. That is complete. Okay, I'm almost there. Sweet. Okay, this is looking really nice. Uh, so what I'm gonna grab is we do have some a few other things I crafted like the sand barriers We have the barbed wire and we do have some campfires because obviously it's gonna be a lot darker in here So we're gonna try to get some of that stuff situated. So 
I'm going to start clearing out some window spots here. I'm thinking, let me see, what's the best go-to here? Oh, we got some more stone? Yeah, here, Let's I'll drop see. it. Here we go, Jazzer to the delivery. Thank you. Lots of stone. Oh, I don't geez. think this will make a whole lot, though. That's the thing. Each uh, wall, 32 or something. We don't really need too much. I think the only issue is we might be out of, uh, what's it called? Um blueprints i actually only have three more i think unless i have more in my e-chest no i do not I, okay i can go buy more three no i don't rip yeah that's that was all of them 550 per blueprint man which is really expensive i was thinking the same thing when i was buying these and i had thirty thousand. i have now like five thousand dollars left oh. so yeah, you can really go through a lot of money trying to build your own base. It takes a lot. I got a lot of blueprints. Oh, you do? Okay, sweet. One minute, I'm just finishing up this side of the wall. Here we go. Oh, there you are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that, the funny part is you see all of this and you think it's not worth anything. Oh my, it's still going. What the heck? <laughs> How many oh. did you get? Well, I'm at 30k now. You? Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. My inventory is full. What in the I'll world? Pick some up. Yeah, pick some up. <laughs> pick up the. Wow. Okay, we just. Okay, that right there is like 30,000. That's ridiculous. All right. So we definitely have enough stone walls now for sure. More than enough. Uh, did you use all the stone? Where'd it go? Or do you have it on you? Oh, I have it on me. All right. Cool. Yeah. So I'm just going to do that real quick. Someone set a bounty, which is something we should utilize. I think in the next episode, uh, I want to set a bounty on someone and see how that works out. That would be kind of fun. And then we can set a reward. That would be cool. All right, just need to finish this wall here. Oh, what? <laughs> Chazzer, what? He set a $10,000 bounty on me? What is this? Yeah, dude. Oh, my God. I spoke I too soon. I want people to come find you. Okay, this is going to be interesting. All right, so the person who does... All right, so this... Zesty's like, what? <laughs> All right, so this is going to be interesting. The person who does kill me... I think Zesty's going to be here in any second to try to kill me. They'll, they'll get the money, and it'll be like a challenge, I guess. For real, yeah, Zesty's definitely on his way. <laughs> oh, no. What have we done here? Okay, this is going to be interesting. Then have some peaches so we can stay hydrated. <laughs> Good idea. And all right, oh, I'm gonna throw the rest of this uh, in here. Fires back here. Um, throw some of these blueprints in here. All right, so now we're gonna work on the main thing, which is what I wanted to do was the windows. So I'm gonna get some sand barriers, and this is where I'm gonna need your advice, Jazzard. This is a pretty big deal. The sand barriers are three blocks. So what I'm thinking of doing is I'm thinking of removing the bottom uh, floor of stone <laughs> and putting sand barriers. Yeah, it works. Would that look kind of cool? Yeah, no, we can, and then we'll just plop some windows on the top there. Do we? Yeah. Do you want sandbags like right along the bottom? Yeah, I feel like if we remove the like the bottom stone wall, we'll put a few of these. So one, two, three, one, two, three. It'll be just enough to fill it up. Yeah, sure. Let's try it. Um, or we can just do a set. Let's just focus on a center point for now. Actually, sure. Let me see if that looks cool. It's kind of weird taking apart the base right now. Feels <laughs> weird. Okay, so if I put this here, like that, now what I want to do is add the windows at the top. So I'm trying to think before I break the stone wall, I have extras, but how should I go about it? Should I just do. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, no, no, think? no. Only do the bottom one because I don't. Having a two block would be a little risky. Dangerous. Yeah. yeah, I agree with that. Watch out, watch out. Start there we go. That. that looks cool. I really like Ooh. this a lot. I think this is yeah, great. And that. what I could do is I have some barbed wire. I could put barbed wire on the corner. That works. But yeah, I don't know if that... Wow, people are placing more bounties. This is a good way to make extra money, I think. Uh, well, let's see. Bounties, yeah. uh, what do you think? What do you, what, what is your... Oh, wait, what if we put, if we take down this stone wall and put a layer? I don't know if that's possible, actually. Oh, put another sandbag up there? Yeah, that was, that's possible. That's possible? Mm-hmm. 
wouldn't it fall? Does it have to sit on a on a layer? No. So I could I, I could take Pretty down sure the oh, okay, cool. Alright, well we'll try it. Let's test it out. That would be kind of cool. Uh oh yeah, I don't think it's possible. Oh really? Damn. <laughs> so right. we'll do I mean I could always add I have an extra stone wall, a few more extra pieces of it. So I can All always right. add the stone wall here. But I'm thinking actually let me do that now. So we can have the um the bottom part removed and still have some type of protection. So let's cool. do that. Okay, I really like this, and I think what I want to do is somewhat replicate this on maybe every side. Like maybe I'm not, I don't think I want to do anything on the back here, but I want to replicate it a little bit. I'm trying to figure out where would be a cool spot. So mm -hmm. I know we have the stairs here, and what we could do with the stairs is we can add a wall here separating the room. Okay. Oh, wait, that's actually a great idea. I'm going to try this right now. So from the stairs... I'll put a two block. So like right here. And then we'll have another room. Oh, this would be really cool. Ooh. So pretty much as oh, you walk. So we can take cover. Yeah, exactly. So on this side, we can have an area for cover. And we can also open it up. And we won't have to worry about other people kind of, you know, taking us from oh, both sides. Oh, good idea. I think that would work out kind of nice. One, two, three, four, five. How many? Two, three, four, five. Okay, so there's no way we can make this even, so it's not a big deal. Um, I have one more stone Dude. wall, which I'll put right here. Cool. Here we go. So now we can do something kind of cool where we'll have the like focal point um, upstairs. So this could be like all military style combat, you know what I mean? Good idea, man. Um, you know, if we really wanted to, to make it all fancy, we could place stone or uh, Sand those bags. barriers up there. Or what is it, the sandbag bears? Yeah. Or, or do we do a ceiling? What do you Ceiling's think? a better idea. Yeah, Don't I feel listen. like... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I think we can... Do you want to do a, a stone ceiling or wooden ceiling? Uh, No, I, I, I suggest a stone, stone ceiling. All right, so we'll stick with stone. All right, that works with me. All right, so what I'm going to do then on this side is I'm going to replicate what we just did on the front. So okay. we have kind of a view from here i think that that would look cool and like i said in the comment sections let me know your suggestions and feedback and what else we could do with this base i'm trying to make it as cool as possible um from the inside i really don't know how amazing it's going to look from the outside but it's definitely an upgrade definitely an upgrade oh for sure yeah oh you know what i'm thinking we can mm. also continue a stone wall here so that way there's like two rooms do you, well, if we do have another wall here, do you want a door or no? Nah? Uh, I don't know. That's a good point. I'm not oh. entirely sure. So you're um, saying like if I yeah, add, but... oh, that'll be kind of tight. We don't really need it. It would be a two-way gap and like you could just walk in, you know? Oh my God. I think there's a, I think there's a guy outside, dude. Oh, no way. <laughs> really? It, yeah, a hundred, hundred meters away. Hundred meters away. Is he crossing the bridge? I don't see any zombies I, aggroed. Is, is that him over there? I love or how we're like. Is that just zombies? <laughs> wait, wait. You're gonna see this on the face cam, but you know how like through the window, like you have to duck. To, oh, he's shooting people. Yeah, he's across the bridge somewhere. But in the face cam, I was like crouching down just to kind of see if I could see through. He looks like he has a juggernaut outfit on. Oh, he's shooting. He's, he's shooting. Get off my lawn. <laughs> Oh, I oh love that. man, he's down. I love that. Okay, so what I want to do is also add... Um, I think I want to add a barrier on this side. I'm going to just try to make this look pretty cool. So as you walk up the stairs, Oops. you're going to have sand barrier here, sand barrier here. That would look kind of cool. Let's see how this looks. So it kind of looks interesting. You know, as you walk up, you have the sand barriers, and it just kind of feels pretty cool. Damn, I'm going to let you design my next base. <laughs> and then what I want to try to do is... Let me see what other types of things I can build with what I have for supplies. I have a few more blueprints, some wood. I have some campfires, so I'm going to bring some campfires up there. I have some barbed wire, another sand barrier. All right, let's see. Um, I could do another stone wall. I'll do a few of those. I'll do two more stone walls. Should I do any stone doors? 
Uh, stone doors, yes. Yeah. So I'll do one stone door. That's all the supplies for now. All right, let's take a look and see how this looks. So, oh, I forgot to do platforms or like a ceiling. We can always do that in another episode, which is not a yeah, big deal. Yeah, we'll the roof later, roof later. Yeah, so let me see. What I want to do is see if I can... Okay, this will be kind of cool. I'm just going to give this a shot here. And then I'll be able to remove, I believe, a sandbag. Right? Or is um, it going to remove the whole thing? Oh, sweet. There we go. That looks so cool, dude. I'm liking this. Let me know what we you guys put think. Campfires right here. <laughs> yeah, I like this a lot. This is going to be a cool. And then once we have the ceiling in place, it'll look amazing. All right, Damn. so we'll do one with the stone door here. Yeah, I know that works. Or the other option was to have stone. Nah, I don't know. I feel like we don't have to worry about that as much. I think the stone door should be placed here, and that would be kind of cool looking. So let's try that. Oh, oh that's nice. I like and that. And then what we could do is we can add a passageway so you can kind of see through. I can maybe add two two windows here. Sure. Um, wasn't the point of the walls to kind of take cover, though? Oh, wait. Yeah, you're right. That's true. Okay, that works out. Um, I have two more walls, so I'm going to try to put a wall here. It'll be oh. a little bit... Actually... What, oh, what do you think? Outside. Oh, is it really? Eight meters. Oh. Oh, <gasps> whoa! Oh! Oh, no, he claimed it! Oh, no, he threw a grenade. That's what I mean, dude. What? Wait, hold on. We just experienced someone winning $10,000. Wow. Oh, no. Someone just claimed the... You, you just lost $10,000. How do you feel? <laughs> Sad actually that is ridiculous no and the whole time we were wondering all right why are people coming to our base now we know <laughs> it was a freaking bounty <laughs> oh dang oh uh oh there was a bounty on me what i had 20k who i definitely uh -oh. did not set the bounty on you uh oh no that wasn't me i promise D damn oh what we just oh all right, we did that to ourselves. I'm not going to lie. That, that was... Brutal. Oh, man. That that That's a rip moment. Oh, lame. <laughs> we just lost, guys. That's what it is. All right, so I'm going to put a stone wall. Um, I think this is what I'm going to do. Stone wall here. And then another stone wall on the other side. That way we can have some safety because I think that's the issue there. We weren't really protected. I feel like if I added these stone walls, that grenade wouldn't have killed me. Yeah. Sorry. He's like, oh, wow, that was easy. I'm like, well, whatever. We weren't really. <laughs> <laughs> we kind of uh, didn't really plan it out too well. No, not, not at all, actually. I, <laughs> I should have said something. All right. So uh, let's add. I actually really like the way this is looking right now. Definitely need to add some campfires. Um, definitely downstairs. I'm pretty sure downstairs is really dark. So I'm going to add campfire. Uh, we really got to work on fixing these chests here too. Yeah, we do need a lot more storage. So yeah, I'm just going to put one in here for now. Oh, there we go. That's a bit better. And then we don't really need any more down here. We're definitely going to have to work on storage. hundred percent. Yeah, definitely here. Place them on the corner there. Should I place one right here? Yeah. That'll look cool. And then we oh, can... Is that, oh, oh, wait, that's bar? barbed wire. Oh. 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 All right, there we go. No worries. What? Can you not break barbed wire? Oh, barbed wire cutters. One minute. Oh, that's what we need. Makes sense. Oh, uh, what was I looking for? Campfire. So I'm going to put a campfire here. There we go. Check out if there's any... I don't think there's anyone else nearby outside, right? Uh... No, only Galaxy Wars 126. So someone just made potentially thirty thousand dollars. Actually, it was two people, and two they all they had gear and and they had grenades. <laughs> so, solid stuff. <laughs> solid stuff. Um, all right, I have one more barbar. I really need that. All right, this has been a pretty successful base build. Like we have fortified 
this area for the most I part. I like this. I like it a oh. lot. I think it adds like like you have pretty much a good perspective, and I'm not too worried about what's behind us here because that's where the water is. Mm -hmm. And over here we have a clear vantage point. I mean, we can easily add a window, like in this corner or somewhere if we really wanted to, or potentially like right here. But that's where the stairs are, so I don't know. You guys can let me know in the comment sections. And yeah, I'm pretty happy with the way this turned out. So I, like I said, I, I tried to see if we can potentially sneak in an, an opportunity to go and look for some supplies. But because this took already 20 minutes of base building, we're going to end off today's episode with just the complete base, which we did a lot. I feel like, is there anything else that we can add, do you think? Um, Besides the roof, not, not much, and more storage, which is something we can work on. Yeah, and we can probably add two chests over here That's for um for an opportunity for people to grab like guns if we need to defend the base yeah do i have anything in my e chest we're for that? probably gonna want to put light here as well because zombies can spawn up yeah here and... that is true wow i forgot my vault is packed with things i'm definitely gonna have to like <laughs> organize everything as well but yeah, this has been pretty good, Jazz. I like this. I think we got destroyed in the bounty. But wait, I have a good idea. I think in the next episode, it's our mission to like kind of hit back with the bounty. Um, and maybe we can set a challenge. We'll give away like a lot of money for a bounty. And we'll have to pretty much uh, be out in the open and defend ourselves. Yeah, that works. I'm, I'm hyped about that. Let's do it. Deal. That's a deal. All right, guys. If you enjoyed today's episode... Make sure you go ahead and smack that like button. Let's see if we can reach 100 likes for today's episode. We did a lot on the base, so I'm really happy with the way it turned out. We still have a lot more to go, but that is pretty much it for today's episode. Stay tuned for more. Check out the Discord for the Crafting Dead. And I promised, like I mentioned in the last episode and people have been requesting in the comment sections, I will be making a tutorial on how to download the Crafting Dead mod pack as well and expect that to come out in the next few days. See you guys next time. My name is Alex, and peace out and stay foxy.